everyone and welcome to my channel in this video I'll be showing you how to crochet these 0 to 3 months firefighter boots okay let's just get right into it and for the yarn the pinya I'll be using studio classic by Nicole I got this from AC more craft so I think you can only get this from AC more Gray is a red hot super saver, and for the crochet hook, I'm using three millimeter. Okay, and if you don't have this brand, you can use this brand as well. Okay, now let's make a slip knot. And chain ten. And now I'll make three double crochet into the third chain from the hook. So one, two, three, three double crochet here. And now I'll make one double crochet into the next six stitch. And now I'll make six double crochet into this chain. And now I'll make one double crochet into the next six stitch. Okay, now I make three double crochet into this loop. It's the same loop where I made the three double crochet earlier. Oh, slip stitch into the first double crochet. Okay, for round two, start with chain one and I'll make two single crochet into the next three stitches. So one, two, three. So two single crochet into the first stitch, two single crochet into the second stitch, and two single crochet into the third stitch. Now I'll make one single crochet into the next three stitch so one two three and now i'll make one half double crochet into the next two stitch one and two And now I'll make two half double crochet into the next eight stitch. So. Crochet into the eight stitch. Now make two half double crochet, one and one into the next stitch. And now make one single crochet into the next three stitch. One, two, three. And now make two single crochet into the next three stitch. One, two, three. Two single crochet. Two single crochet. And two single crochet. Now slip stitch and let's start with round number three and by the end of round two you should have 38 stitches okay let's start with round three so round two is going to be 
front post half double crochet in every stitch so start with chain one and I'm going to make the first front post half double crochet so yarn over so go instead of going under the stitch from here I'll go here and go over the first stitch okay and I'll show you again yarn over go under this V stitch around and over so you'll make 38 front post half double crochet so I'll do the same all the way to the last stitch okay I'll see you once I'm done and 38 front post half double crochet so but so slip stitch and I'm going to cut the yarn and now let's change to gray yarn okay for round number four I'm gonna pull the yarn from where I ended the pin yarn right here and chain one and now I'm going to make one half double crochet all the way to the end okay so going to be 38 stitches one okay now this is my last stitch I'm going to slip stitch so this is how it looks like right now okay for round five start with chain one now I'll make one single crochet into the next 10 stitch so starting from the stitch next to chain one so <clears throat> one <clears throat> okay now I'll make one half double crochet into the next two stitch so one here and one here two and now I'm going to decrease the front part so I'm going to make seven double crochet decrease okay so yarn over Pull the yarn and pull two yarn. Now you have to loop on the hook, yarn over into the stitch, pull the yarn. Now you have four, yarn over and pull two loop. Now you have three and yarn over and pull all three the same time so I'm going to repeat this for seven times so I made one I'm going to make six more decrease one so now I have all seven decrease one two three four five six seven okay now I'll make one half double crochet into the next two stitch one and two one half double crochet and one half double crochet and now I'll make one single crochet into every stitch all the way to the end so there's one single crochet into the next ten stitch and 10 
now slip stitch into the first stitch and so this is how it looks like now okay for the next round round six i'll make one slip stitch um, the reason for me to make one slip stitch to the next stitch because i want my work to start from the middle all the time so i have the even decrease at this front part okay so now this is where the work ends i want it to start from here okay so i'll slip stitch into the next stitch here now it is at the center so the work will be even Okay, now I'll make one single crochet into the next eighth stitch. So starting from the stitch next to chain one. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight. Now I'll make one half double crochet. So one half double crochet. Okay, so now I'll make one half double crochet decrease. So <clears throat> yarn over into the stitch, pull the yarn. Now there's three loops on the hook. Yarn over again into the next stitch, pull the yarn. And now there's five loops on the hook. Yarn over and pull the yarn through all five loops. Okay. So now I'll make two double crochet decrease. So this is the first decrease and this is the second decrease okay now I'll make one double crochet into the next stitch now make two double crochet decrease so one first double crochet decrease and this is the second double crochet decrease okay and now i'll make one half double crochet decrease and now let's make one half double crochet and make one single crochet all the stitch all the way to the end so there's eight single crochet so one and eight now slip stitch so this is how it looks like now and if you can see I ended the work at the middle of the shoes so I do not need to slip one more stitch okay okay for the next round chain one and now I'll make one single crochet into the next nine stitch so one eight and nine now i'll make one single crochet decrease so into the stitch pull the yarn now there's two into the next stitch pull the yarn and now there's three the yarn over and pull all through three loops okay now i make one single crochet into the next three stitch one two three so one three now make another one single crochet decrease one two and now make one single crochet into the next nine stitch one nine 
so slip stitch into the first stitch here and <clears throat> now this is how it looks like so for the next round this is I'm going to make round 8 until round 10 is going to be the same pattern so start with chain 2 1 2 and I'm going to make one double crochet in every stitch all the way till the end okay now i'm done with round three slip stitch cut the yarn and now i'll change to pink yarn okay, now just pull the yarn from here where you end up the gray yarn chain one and I'll make one single crochet in every stitch okay so I'll just go into crochet along these two pieces of yarn as I go. Okay, this is the last stitch. Now slip stitch into the first chain. Okay, now for the last round, make chain one and one half double crochet to the next four stitch one two three four okay now I'm going to create this part here now chain seven one two three four five six seven now skip three stitch one two three and half double crochet into the next stitch so one will make nine half double crochet now so this is one two eight, nine okay now let's chain seven again one now skip three stitch one two three and make one half double crochet into the next four stitch so one two three and four now we are done with the shoes slip stitch chain one to secure and I cut this yarn off and I'm going to weave in these ends and I'll see you once I'm done with that and there you have it this is the finished boot for zero to three months baby and I do hope my video is easy for you to follow do subscribe for more video in the future and thank you for watching see you again